But first, Pittsburgh's team, Lillis. It's one of the proudest moments a family can have. One of their sons qualified for the Olympics and will represent the United States on the world stage. But in this time of uplifting euphoria, there's an unspeakable sorrow that lingers for the Lillis family. On a January weekend in Lake Placid, John Lillis lands a jump to send him to a World Cup final on the course where he developed into a world-class athlete. Jonathan, that was beautiful! Surrounded by more than 50 friends and family, Team Lillis was in full force. When we have that family support and the family crowd and all those people cheering, it kind of gets the blood boiling at the temperature that you want and uh, gets you in the mood to go. This competition has extra meaning because John is jumping for more than just himself. Just weeks before Team USA was announced, Chris Lillis, John's younger brother and a member of the United States ski team, tore his ACL. While only one Lillis brother will compete in the Olympics, the boys say they are part of Team Lillis. When I got hurt, you know, I went up, I crutched up to the knoll of the, of the jump site, and 15 minutes after I found out I blew my knee and watched John compete and cheered him on to a pretty good result. And uh, so throughout that whole process, when I had my surgery, he's been there for me and I've been going to the events and just, you know, kind of watching his journey to the Olympics. That brotherly bond was made all the more close last October when tragedy struck. They are beside themselves with grief and more questions than they can answer. In October, Mikey Lillis, the youngest of the three brothers, went to sleep in his parents' house and never woke up. At just 17 years old, he passed away. It's also just you're on an emotional roller coaster doing that. Um. Bernie Lillis is the father of John, Chris, and Mikey. And along with his wife, Jamie, the Lillis family made sure that Mikey's spirit would live on during the Olympic season. The family made sweatshirts honoring the memory of Mikey, and Team Lillis is still going strong. Michael is his brother's biggest fan, and so it's really difficult, but I always seem to feel he's kind of smiling down on him at a competition. He wouldn't want you to be sad, and he's here in spirit. Olympic dreams now rest on the shoulders of John, and he says he will represent more than just the United States over in Pyeongchang. Skiing for both my brothers, just doing it for both of those guys and uh, trying to make them proud any way I can. The Lillises are parishioners of St. Mary's Church in downtown Rochester, and in January, a mass was held in Mikey's honor. It was that same weekend that John landed his jump to qualify for the Olympics. Someone was looking down from above on John Lillis.